think that's in alignment with where you're going makes you on, motherfucker. And when you're off, what the fuck does off mean? It means you're off the path you want to be on. So internally, you don't feel correct. There's a rip. You're trying to convince your mind of something your heart knows is alive. That that act you're engaged in actually suits you. Drop whole fucking heartily that which does not suit you and pursue wholeheartedly that what does. This is all it is. The morning, personal development. Personal development in the morning. The midday, business. The end of the day, family. Family, fitness, awareness. Mind, body, soul. There's only broken into threes. You guys think that pleasure seeking is life? Pleasure seeking is life? To me, you chase purpose. And by this way of living, you're granted the ultimate pleasures, which is true, lasting contentment by being in alignment with what you see yourself as. If you're not in alignment, nothing is going to feel correct. You will forever feel that rift internally. And the only thing that kicks us out of alignment is the chasing of these selfish desires. Falling victim to these selfish desires. I've been in the worst situations imaginable and still knew, still knew I was creating and cultivating an individual that was going to get everything he was after. Pure alignment with your authentic self, everything goes your way. It just ends up always being the most beautiful day. You feel great because you're in control. Everything that ails you, the cure is internal. Learn to live from the program that I teach and you'll see the smallest deviation in your macros puts you off. Because now your level of what's on is so much greater. Being on means to a T. At my level, being on is to the fucking gram. If I'm off with my macros to the gram, then I don't feel right. I know I'm at 85%. If I don't murder my workout and get as close as I can to my macros as possible, that I feel what people call off. And they probably feel off from a night of fucking just getting smashed and being a dumb fuck. That's how far off they are. The urgency to your call at this is everything. Those of you who your call is massively urgent, it's massively loud for you to change, you have a greater calling and it's fucking being dictated by the universe. It's calling you more and more and more. The people who don't hear the call that loud, it's not their time. If you're hearing the call that loud, the fucking urgency to you to, the, to fucking fall in a line with this path is at the highest degree. So what I'm trying to teach you is that it's the most simple shit. It's the most simple shit. It's mind, body, soul growth. Personal development. You will never, your success level will never exceed your level of personal development. Success is something you attract by the person you've become. You don't have much in life because you're not valuable. You haven't become of value to self to become valuable to others. Once you learn what works for you, you can then teach this to others. This is the reality of it. Stop looking for the hack. Stop selling yourself short. Stop fucking around. There's no need for it. All the vices, everything that must be dropped is what's in your way. When you get rid of all the bullshit, you'll realize how much time has just been freed up. I do not have any time for any of that shit. You have a problem with going out at night? Get up earlier. If you get up at 2.45, 10 p.m. doesn't exist to you. You're fucking done. Fatigue is the best motherfucking pillow. Fatigue yourself. Stay away from these areas. It's the biggest thing, you guys. These vices are fucking you over. They land motherfuckers in prison for a long time. And guess what? Not just physically in prison. The self-imposed prison of a lesser motherfucker known as mediocrity. This most sickening prison known to man. I would have rather gone to a real prison and have my eyes open than live a life based on mediocrity my whole fucking existence. When I knew I was fucking capable of such greater things. All the motherfuckers in the penitentiary. Child's picture in hand. Tears running down the face. Super fucking emotional. Ten minutes later, the dope man walks in the building. Then forget all about it. 
selling out everything they ever dreamed for and loved for selfish fucking desires out of weakness. Straight bitch shit. That motherfucker who'd rather go suck down an 18 pack with his buddies than hang out with his fucking wife and kids. Fucking pussy. You're not aligned with your vision. My vision is my wife, my son, and helping others through this business and getting myself to the level I need to be to be the most successful husband and father and friend and fucking motherfucking role model that I can possibly be. I do nothing but this. You're sending a mixed signal to the universe by trying to do so many different fucking things in your life. Mind, body, soul, family, fitness, finance. That is it. That is it. You don't have time for more. In all reality, mastery of something takes about eight years. You should have mastered a few things already by now if you're in your 40s. I mean, I was a master drug dealer. I snowboarded at a high level. Now I'm mastering fitness and business. This is the thing. Master drug dealer 